Now see, I am talking of even numbers. So this trick is valid only for even numbers. Now let us start even numbers from zero to ten. That is single digit even numbers. Suppose you have four and you need to multiply it by six. We all know that it is twenty-four. But I just want to tell you the trick first, and then we will get on with higher examples. See, this is number is four, so our unit digit will be four itself. So whenever you multiply an even number by six, you will have the same number at the unit place, which is there in this number. So multiplying four by six will give you a number which ends with four. And next step, what is half of four? It is two, so just try two here. You get your answer. So the trick is very very simple, and I'm sure you must be amazed by watching this. What is happening on the board? So let's take one or two more examples of single digit even numbers. Then we will move on to numbers between ten and twenty. Suppose we have eight into six. Now see the number will end with eight, and what is half of it? It is four. So forty eight is the answer. Let's take now numbers be between ten and twenty. Now, what happens when we take numbers between ten and twenty? The method changes slightly. Suppose we have twelve into six. Now, see the unit digit here. The unit digit here is two, so our answer is going to end with two. And what happens now? Now see, twelve into six. We all know that the number which will be obtained is seventy-two, ending with two. So that is correct. And what about this number now? See the number here, four. Half of that is two. Eight. Half of that is four. Twelve. So what is half of twelve? It is six. But don't write six here. Just add the tens digit. So I'll write the rule here. For obtaining the tens place here, you need to half and add one. One is the tens digit here. So half and add one. Half of twelve is six. Six plus one is seven. So you obtain seven, which is the answer seventy two. Let's apply it for fourteen. Fourteen into six. Now see the answer. It will end with four because we have a four here. So what is half of fourteen? It is seven, and plus one, it is eight. So eighty-four is the answer. So we have done numbers up to twenty. Let's take one more example of this kind. Suppose you have eighteen into six. So our answer is going to end end with eight, and what is half of eighteen? Half of eighteen is nine. One more than that, ten. So you have hundred and eight as the answer. How much time will you take to multiply even numbers by six through this method? Just by watching this number, you can tell me the answer. Maybe two seconds, and that's what we require in competitions. We need methods through which we can save a lot of time in competitions. Let's have now numbers between. Twenty and thirty. You can extrapolate this method yourself because once you know the trick, you can work out wonders. Numbers between twenty and thirty. So let's take the example of twenty-four. Now see, four means ending with four, and now half plus. What is the tens digit here? Two. So now half plus two. Just as we did here, half plus one. So now the numbers are in twenties. So you have to half and then add two, which is the tens place. So half of twenty-four is twelve. Twelve plus two is fourteen. So one forty-four is the answer. Let's do two or three more examples. Say we have twenty-six into six. So see the ease with which we can get the answer. Six, thirteen plus two, fifteen. Twenty-eight into six, eight. Fourteen plus two, sixteen. Twenty-two into six, 
टू इलेवन प्लस टू थर्टीन दैट इज द अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम यू विल ऑल्सो टेक वेन यू हैव टू मल्टीप्लाई दीज नंबर लेट्स मूव ऑन वी हैव नंबर बिटवीन थर्टी एंड फोर्टी So now you know the rule, so you can generalize very easily. I'll move up to fifty and then leave it to you for more calculations. So thirty-four into six. So we have a four here. Half of this. So now what you have to do? Half plus three because the number is between thirty and forty, which starts with three. So half of thirty-four is seventeen plus three is twenty. So two zero four is the product, and you don't need to verify. Even if you verify using the calculator, you will take more time than actual uh, application of this trick. Let's see thirty eight. See eight. Half of this nineteen plus three twenty two. So two hundred and twenty eight. Let's move on to numbers between forty and. Fifty. Say let's take forty-two into six, ending with two. So this will end with two. And now what we do? Half and add four because the number is starting with four. So twenty-one plus four twenty-five. Two fifty-two is the product of forty-two and six. Let's take forty-four and six, ending with four. So we have four here. Half is twenty-two plus four twenty-six two sixty-four is the product. Forty-eight into six, ending with eight. So we have a eight here. Half of this is twenty-four plus four twenty-eight. So two eighty-eight is the product. So friends, how much time you are going to take to solve this? But remember, the trick is applicable only for even numbers to be multiplied with six. mathematics tricks are particular you cannot generalize a trick to other numbers so for everything you have a different trick and that's what makes maths interesting let's take some more examples in which i will be dealing with numbers beyond 50 let's have the examples of One number in fifties, then one in sixties, seventies, eighties, and nineties, and then you can generalize. See the example is fifty-six into six. Now see six half plus five. Half is twenty-eight. Twenty-eight plus five thirty-three. So three thirty-six is the product. Let's take sixty. Eight into six, half eight will come as it is. Then half of this thirty-four plus six forty, so four zero eight. Let's take seventy-four into six, so ending with four. Half is thirty-seven plus seven forty-four, so triple four is the product. Let's take eighty-two. Into six, so ending with two ends with two. Half is forty-one plus eight forty-nine, so four hundred and ninety-two is the product. What about eighty-six into six? So ending with six, half is forty-three. Forty-three plus eight is fifty-one, so five one six is the product. Let's take ninety-four. So four ninety four the half is forty seven plus nine fifty six so five sixty four is the product ninety six into six ending with six so half is forty eight plus nine fifty seven so five seventy six is the product finally ninety eight into six ending with six. Sorry, ending with eight because we have a eight here. The half of this is forty-nine plus nine fifty-eight. Five eighty-eight is the product. 
हेलो फ्रेंड्स अपने सारे मैथ्स के डाउट्स के इंस्टेंट सॉल्यूशंस के लिए आप डाउनलोड कर सकते हैं डाउटनेट ऐप मेरी परखी हुई ऐप है और मैंने देखा है कि कोई भी क्वेश्चन अगर उसकी फोटो क्लिक करके आप इस ऐप पर भेज दें तो आपको वो सॉल्यूशन जो है वो वीडियो के फॉर्म में आप तक पहुंच जाएगा वो भी पूरा फ्री ऑफ कॉस्ट आई एक्सपर्ट्स आपको ये सॉल्यूशंस देते हैं और सिर्फ अब मैथ्स नहीं फिजिक्स केमिस्ट्री और बहुत सारे सब्जेक्ट्स में आप इस ऐप का फायदा उठा सकते हैं तो आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट ऐप